We have all heard how cute and adorable and amazing Shih Tzus are. However, you realize a few things only after getting one of these cute monsters. So today, in this video, we will go through things nobody tells you about owning a Shih Tzu. Number one, Shih Tzu's well-known gorgeous long coat <laughs> is really high maintenance. The moment we got Bella, I wanted her to have a long and silky coat when she grew up. Little did I know, such a coat requires a lot of maintenance. You need to brush it every day to keep it from getting tangled. Then bathe them with a good quality shampoo and conditioner regularly. Apart from that, you also need to take them to a groomer every now and then for a professional touch. Then you also need to give them good quality food and add some extra supplements to keep their coat healthy and shiny. <laughs> it's a lot of work. Number two, they can be stubborn. In the past, Shih Tzus were kept by Chinese royals, where they lived in luxury. Well, I have even read that Chinese royals hired other people just to take care of their Shih Tzus. Unlike many other breeds, they were not bred as working, guard, or herding dogs. Instead, they were bred to be indoor companion dogs. As they don't have any past traits of obedience, they have become a little stubborn. So it is very important to start the training as soon as possible and be consistent with it. Number three, they can be clingy to their owners. Shih Tzus were bred to accompany their owners. Literally, their only duty was to be their human companion. Modern Shih Tzus are nothing different. All they want to do is sit on your lap all day long. They are super clingy. They will follow you around the house, wanting to be as close as possible to you. This may seem cute, but their desire to love and be loved makes them prone to separation anxiety. Number four, they need a lot of attention. You need to spend time with your Shih Tzu, play with them, take them out for walks. Then there's training and lots of grooming. Your Shih Tzu will demand quite a bit of your attention. Number five, they are difficult to house train. House training a Shih Tzu is one of the most difficult obstacles parents face. You see, Shih Tzus have a small bladder and it becomes really difficult to time it. So initially, you will need to take them outside every two hours and be really patient with the training. It may not be possible for some people. So I suggest first training them to pee inside the toilet. And when they grow up and have better bladder control, take the training outside. Number six, you need to trim their face hair regularly. Shih Tzus are prone to eye problems caused due to long facial hair. So it is essential to trim them regularly. I prefer taking my Bella to a professional groomer for this because I'm very clumsy. However, many people do do this at home. Number seven, they are indoor dogs. If you live an outdoorsy life and want an active dog who can do outdoor activities with you, like hiking or swimming, then Shih Tzu may not be the right option. They may enjoy a walk around the block or some outdoor time with family, but they are not built to spend lots of time outside. And even after all these things, I simply love this breed because of how friendly, even tempered and playful they are. I hope this video was helpful to you. Make sure to like this video and subscribe to my channel for more Shih Tzu Care videos. See ya!